Hi guys and welcome to St. Kitts. In just a few seconds, we'll be on our way across the water to the stunning little island of Nevis. We've left the airport and are on our way to Cockleshell Bay to hop on the water taxi that'll take us over to Nevis. Along the way, we'll see some beautiful views such as the stunning Timothy Hill Overlook. The 360 views here include both the Atlantic Ocean and Caribbean Sea with Nevis in the background. So sit back, relax, enjoy the ride and take in the views. Be sure to keep your camera poised and ready. The views are simply amazing. We've arrived, our water taxi is waiting. The beach here is so calm and inviting. All aboard, it will be about a six minute journey across the water to Nevis. Enjoy the views with an ice cold complimentary ting. We've arrived at the boat dock at Wally Beach. Welcome to Nevis. Now that we're on island, let's take a look at my five favorite hotels, starting with the Four Seasons. The lobby provides a luxurious welcome with breathtaking views of the Caribbean Sea. There's a photo op waiting around every corner here. Let's take a look at this ocean view room. The decor here boasts a soothing Caribbean color palette with lush fabrics, mahogany accents, and local artwork. Enjoy the sunset from your private patio or balcony. The grounds are super lush with striking views of Nevis Peak. Let's take a look at the Peak View Suite. I would honestly choose the views from this room over the Ocean View room any time. That doesn't happen often. Next up, Montpellier Plantation and Beach. This is a boutique hideaway designed as a place where you can let the rest of the world slip away. Let's take a look at the premier room where the vibe is fresh and airy. It is the perfect balance between open living and refined comfort. Enjoy your own private terrace and soak up the tropical garden views. The Indigo Restaurant is my favorite hangout at the hotel and is the epitome of easygoing island dining. The food is amazing too. On the way to our next hotel, we'll take a little detour through Charlestown. Golden Rock Inn. Let's check it out. Sitting on 100 acres stretching up the slopes of Nevis Peak, 11 guest rooms offer privacy, glorious tropical gardens, and sea views toward the islands of Antigua and Montserrat. Discover lively Caribbean cuisine paired with global flair at the rocks. Fresh fish and lobster come from local fishermen, while tropical fruits and vegetables from neighboring growers. Let's take a look at a hillside room. These cottages are perched above and around the swimming pool amidst the gardens. While they don't offer air conditioning, they do have a large veranda offering views from the cool mountainside to the sea below. 
enjoy a refreshing rum punch at the hotel's bar. Nisbet Plantation Beach Club. Experience life in the slow lane here at Nisbet. Rest, relax, unwind, and rejuvenate. Wander along a secluded beach and dip your toes in the shallow waters. The Garden View Deluxe Suite offers the peace and quiet of a tranquil garden setting with nothing to disturb you but the wind in the palms. Each cottage comes with a welcome treat, ting with a sting. Enjoy this refreshing grapefruit drink with a local rum. Sabre's is a fun, laid-back Caribbean beach bar and restaurant. Enjoy snacks or lunch in its open-air restaurant by the water. Stick your toes in the sand for true beach dining. Make sure you get to enjoy the number one drink, a Novesian sunset at the bar. Last but not least, the sexy Paradise Beach Nevis. This two-bedroom beach house is perfect for couples or friends, featuring a contemporary Caribbean style that offers the highest standards of guest comfort. The beach house offers tranquility and breathtaking views of the ocean. Feel free to enjoy drinks and conversation at the beach bar. Paradise Beach offers a number of flexible dining options. Can't forget the rum punch. Thanks for watching. I truly hope you'll consider a trip to Nevis. The shy little island is waiting for you. Please be sure to like and subscribe.